Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. This is another uh, video. Uh, it's uh, uh, I want to do that for uh, charter communication. Uh, it's really wild, you know. The uh, and again, it's done millions of times, and to a lot of us uh, people that we don't have the right to live without being frauded, intimidated, uh, uh, put in the system, I mean, jailed, in prison, uh, go to all different programs, like uh, it, it, the one that I, it was really, I, I, I thought, oh man, that's great, opportunity knocks. <laughs> and when I came out, I went to there, the opportunity knocks, knocked me in my head, and I was unbelievable, unbelievable what these people, you know, they think that they, uh, they think that they really sold us, unbelievable. Uh, they uh, charter communication. Uh, first, the uh, explain to them that I have no phone because again they wouldn't uh, give me the lifeline, which is a federal law. Every home has to have a phone for emergency. Well, when they did that, I think they did it so they can track. <laughs> you want to track everybody since it's 2010. You remember they wanted to know where we are. You know, you have no right to live. Uh, you know, if you, you you got to be in uh, in, in one of the settlements or or, or or camps, uh, and you got to have a number, uh, they have to locate you whenever they want to uh, abuse and use and uh, get the funds <laughs> in our names and put you in a certain program. So you you know, uh, so I called the FCC, uh, the Federal Com Communication Commissioner, and the fellow that was there, he was about to hang up on me and uh, tell me he, he couldn't understand, and I'm loud and obnoxious. And he said, oh, well, well you, you have, uh, and I think he was, uh, you know, uh, a gay fellow, uh, and I didn't want to hurt his feelings. Uh, but uh, we we met we met up uh, in the end of the call because I told him you have to understand that I am frustrated because you know uh, I think most of uh, people working for such offices they are not get paid enough and they um, is like when I used to work in the car business you don't sell the lost leader. The ad, the ad car, you don't sell. And if you do, then you got problems. This is the same thing here. Tell them, don't take no complaint. Try to intimidate people, threat them, and tell them that you don't understand them because they are foreigners. Uh, his name is Muhammad or Jose or, 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 or uh, Olga or some. Uh, <laughs> or Kanisha. But anyway... <laughs> The, uh, oh, he has an accent. Okay. Well, I couldn't even understand the southern people, and they speak English. You get to go to the bone and get my horse. Anyway, so the, I, I couldn't under I, I need a translation a translator when I go there, interpreter. But anyway, and uh, finally, uh, I persuade him uh, to take the complaint. And uh, he said, well, go online and do it. I said, I, I don't want to go online because I get dizzy when I go online. Yeah, I get dizzy. Like, I don't know what I'm doing. And, you know, I'm not a computer savvy person. Uh, that's what uh, Mr. Avila told me in 2000 and, uh, 2008. Yeah, Mr. Avila said that you, you 
you're not going to get this position because you are not uh, computer savvy. Uh, and I believed him. <laughs> and Mr. Ron Pierce agreed with him. And uh, he told me, uh, good luck, Mohammed or Mo, good luck to you. I said, no, Mr. Pierce, good luck to you. And I think now he needs the good luck. Anyway, uh, uh, that's it. Oh, what else? That um, Oh, the Department of Social Services. And now I am with Medicare. And I can get no transportation because I refuse to sign with the uh, HMOs. Uh, uh, yeah, Central Health uh, Medicare Plan, HMO. <laughs> I don't want any of these uh, HMOs. I am allergic to them. I like the Medicare. Uh, even though they don't want to give me the silver sneakers, you know, I can go in the gutter and, you know, walk there. That's fine. I don't have to go to the gym. And I can go to the river or the, the, the lake or the stream or anywhere, and I can go and play in the water. <laughs> Swim. Oh, go to Santa Barbara. <laughs> uh, anyway, so now I've been penalized and uh, uh, left here without any uh, doctor transportation. The Skittles, they couldn't, you know, they didn't want to give me the Skittles. I mean, I don't know why, because, you know, I'm, I'm giving them business, you know, getting a lot of Skittles every month. But uh, they didn't want to give it to me. So now I went back with Tommy's Pharmacy, and uh, they take uh, Plan D. Uh, uh, United, uh, they keep uh, one United Americans. This is the biggest drug dealer. <laughs> United, United American, uh, yeah, for the uh, prescription drugs plan, PDP. <laughs> they are the biggest drug cartels. Anyway, uh, well, legal drugs, I'm sorry have to be politically correct. Uh, anyway, that's it. Uh, this is a few things that I wanted to mention. Uh, I hope I, um, I, I included everything that I wanted to say. And if I remember some, I will come back. Assalamu alaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh.